Hello mga Kateki! Welcome back to my channel sa mga hindi pa nakasubscribe dyan. Subscribe na kayo guys because we have another unboxing here. Talaga namang maraming nilalabas na bagong phones ang Poco brand. So now we have the Poco M3 phone. Unbox na natin to! nakapag-unbox ako ng Poco X3 Pro. Now, what we have is a cheaper model ng Poco phone. This is the Poco M3. And very typical, yellow ang kulay ng Poco box. And we have some logo here or name. Ayan, sa side, sa front. And some barcodes here at the bottom. And some things about this phone. There are three colors of Poco M3. The black, the blue, and of course, my favorite color, yellow. And that's what we have here, guys. I got this phone specifically sa Lazada. There are two variants of this Poco M3. The 64GB for 6,990. And what I got here is a 4GB RAM, 128GB ROM for 7,990. So 1,000 difference for the 64 and the 128GB. But no kinuha ko to or nung nabili ko to sa Lazada, naka-sale or discounted itong phone na to. So for 7,990, nung binili ko, siya naka-sale siya for 6,490. And then, ginamit ako ba ng vouchers? Kaya umabot lang siya ng 5,600. So, not bad guys, di ba? From almost 8,000. Ang presyo, nakuha ko lang siya ng 5,600. So, let's open it. On top, we have this small box. And nakalagay, Poco. Sa loob nito, we have the ejector pin. We also have some user guide and warranty card. And of course, the case, a soft clear case for this Poco phone. Pagbalik sa box guys, the rest is the phone. Ayan, kitang kita ng kanyang pagkadilaw. We also have here a USB Type-C to USB cable and the adapter itself. Walang earphones guys, unfortunately sa baba kasi ng presyo talagang bumabawi na lang sila sa pagtanggal ng earphones. So balik tayo dito sa mismong phone, ayan, Poco M3 at nakalagay dito sa plastic, meron tong 48 megapixel AI triple camera, 6000 milliampere battery, 6.53 full HD plus dot drop display and Qualcomm Snapdragon 662 na siya. Not bad talaga sa presyo niya. Ito na siya guys. Ang ganda no? Ang ganda ng pagkadilaw niya. Gusto gusto kayo ganitong pagkadilaw. Hindi sobrang dark at hindi rin sobrang light. Anyway, at the back, iba yung texture niya guys. Para siya, mukha siyang leather. Pero of course, hard plastic lang to. So meron lang siyang texture. Kita niyo ba? Parang nikita sa akin camera yung kanyang texture. I will try to post a closer picture of yung texture niya. Para makita nyo yung sinasabi kong texture na parang leather. Pero obviously hindi. Hard plastic lang siya. And pagdating naman sa kanyang camera, merong nakalagay Poco. And we have the super triple cameras. Those camera guys nga pala, yung isa doon ay 48 megapixel which is the main camera. The second one is a 2 megapixel macro camera and the third one is a 2 megapixel depth sensor camera. So side guys, on top we have the speaker grill, a 3.5mm jack port and a mic. On this side we have the volume rocker, nikita na dilong dilo kasi. And here's the volume rocker and a power button which works as a fingerprint sensor as well. Ayan, as a side. And at the bottom guys, we have another speaker grill, USB Type-C port, and another hole for the mic. At the other side naman is the slot for the SIM tray. So front guys, meron na siyang pre-installed plastic film, so not bad. And then we also can see a speaker grill here on top of the camera. Medyo manipis lang siya guys. And ayun yung kanyang 8 megapixel front camera. 
As I've said earlier guys, ang kanyang display is 6.53 dot drop display. Ayan, dot drop dahil ayun ang camera, kitang kita. And in fairness, sa top and on the sides, halos wala ng edge. Pero sa bottom, parang meron konti pa, no? Kita pa. Ang isa pang kapansin-pansin sa phone na to is ang gaan niya, guys. Ito ay 198 grams lang. So, hindi siya parang mababagsak pag hawak mo dahil ang sarap niyang hawakan. May nagawa yung kanyang texture sa likod para siyang may grip pag hawak mo. Saktong-sakto lang din yung lapad niya sa kamay. Yung kanyang phone mismo, hindi rin ganun kahaba. So, parang hindi siya mahirap hawakan. Ang isa pang magandang feature nito guys is yung battery niya, 6,000 mAh. Bihira ang ganitong kamura na phone na ganun kalaki yung battery capacity. So medyo matagal mo talaga itong magagamit. At yung adapter na kasama sa box, yun ay 225 watts charger. At ang kanyang fast charging capability ay hanggang 18 watts. And alam nyo guys, kahit napakamura nito, isa pang kakaibang feature nito ay ang reverse wired charging. Unfortunately, walang kasamang reverse wired charging cable sa box. Regular cable lang yung nasa box. But if you have, you can use this as a charger or parang power bank para ma-charge naman yung ibang device nyo. Dual speakers na rin siya guys. Meron din siyang AI face unlock. And another thing is meron siyang FM radio if you have a 3.5mm jack na headphones. So, we check naman natin, guys, ang kanyang SIM tray. Very nice. Because this one, guys, has two nano SIM slots and a slot for the memory card. And actually, yung 128 gig storage nyo, pwede nyo siyang i-expand using a memory card up to 512 gig. Medyo nalaro ko na yung rear camera niya, guys. At talaga namang... For its price, I think very solid itong phone na to. Not just the battery, the display, the overall look of the phone. Pero malaking bagay kasi na kahit mura yung phone mo, maganda yung camera mo, di ba? And to see those sample pictures, guys, please like and follow my Facebook page, Miss Techie. I will post the sample pictures I got from this phone on my Facebook page. Anong masasabi nyo, guys, dito sa bagong Poco M3 phone. Anyway guys, thank you for watching me unbox this phone and I hope to see you again on my next video. Bye bye mga kateki!